Good evening. I am so glad that you are here to join us for this week's five o'clock Friday. If you are here live, be sure that you are ready with your, in fact, if you're here on the recording too, be sure that you're ready with a pen and a piece of paper or a notebook, something to write in because we are going to have recipes, we're going to have lots of information tonight, and there's going to be lots of tips and advice on how to support your body through essential oils and natural solutions. If we have not met yet, again, my name is Sunny Busby, and I absolutely love to support people who are motivated to expand their essential oil knowledge and to use it as a possibility to boost their health and overall functionality. I am certified in aromatherapy and nutrition, and so I love to incorporate the power of natural solutions to help others find health, happiness, and hope. If you have any questions during our time together, please feel free to post them and I will do my best to respond quickly. Again, if you're here on a recording, feel free to ask those questions in the comments below and I will check in periodically to answer those. If you're here with us live, I will be answering as quickly as I can throughout the presentation. Now that being said, if you have something that you would like to address to me privately, feel free to contact me at it 2 on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter, or you can always email me at it 2 at gmail.com. Be sure that you put your body and essential oils in the subject line so that I know that you have a question in regard to this presentation. With that, let's get started. Okay, so let's pause and say why to Tahara. Now, if this is the first time that you've joined me on any of these webinars, you may be wondering why this certified aromatherapist is aligned with one single essential oil company. Simply stated, when earning my certification studying under a doctor in chemistry, it became poignantly apparent that plant origin, sustainability of growth, proper planting and farming, harvesting time, Sometimes not only down to the day that the plants are harvested, but also the exact time of day that the plants have har are harvested. Their distillation procedures and of course purity are all vital to the quality and efficacy of an essential oil. After years of usage, research, and following multiple third-party aromatic testing sites, it became very clear that doTERRA is quite literally the only brand that meets all of the essential oil needs for efficacy. More importantly, it has been proven time and time again that doTERRA is the only essential oil company offering 100% pure essential oils 100% of the time. Couple this with their dedication to integrity, their focus on fair trade efforts, their Healing Hands organization that provides humanitarian and charitable efforts all throughout the world, doTERRA really has it all. So now when I offer my clients a bottle of peppermint essential oil, I know without a doubt that the only thing contained in that bottle is 100% certified pure therapeutic grade peppermint essential oil. No other company has ever given me such reassurance not in their words, but in their actions and their results. I promise when you put doTERRA to use, you too will see the difference. So with that, let me ask, are you flirting with the idea of a physical relationship with some all natural products? While many brands of essential oils are not recommended to use internally, doTERRA essential oils, when used correctly, can be extremely effective in helping to manage and balance many internal processes and physical reactions. In fact, they have a multitude of effects on the very symptoms and, I'm sorry, systems and organs that of the body, and they can ultimately be used as a regular supplement for their many amazing benefits. Embarking on this lifelong love affair with essential oils is something which many people don't imagine when they buy their first oil. And I'll admit, I fell in love with some of the effects that essential oils had when I was first introduced to them. But when I met doTERRA, I fell hard. The life-changing difference that certified pure therapeutic grade essential oils have made, not just for myself, but for my entire family, have been so wonderful. I can't help but share these. So since it's important to have a basic understanding of essential oils before you use them for any health purpose, 
If this is in the cards for you, please be sure to follow my blog, www.andloveit2.com, or of course, follow me on, at andloveit2 on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and be sure to hit the subscribe button below so that you can stay on top of any new presentations, nutrition, and essential oil information that I share here on YouTube as well. So let's start with the circulatory system. The circulatory system is made up of primarily the heart, lungs, and blood vessels, which work in harmony to pump blood all over the body. These organs must interact smoothly to enable the body to function properly. And as such, anything which aids this smooth operation is definitely considered a positive circulatory aid. Can you imagine optimal heart health? Goodness knows that this has many requirements, one of which is maintaining a low blood pressure, you want good activity levels, and a healthy circulatory system. While we've been brainwashed with heart-healthy medications and pharmaceutical drugs for years, there's only recently been an increase in the interest of benefits which essential oils can have on the body. Activity levels and physical exercises can only boost their, our circulation if the blood vessels involved are open and receptive enough to allow it in the first place. That's where natural essential oils come in. Taking essential oils such as cinnamon bark, cassia, marjoram, and copaiba internally may have the ability to boost cardiovascular functionality. Don't worry, I'll be explaining how you can do this in the next few posts, but know that several of these oils are also included in our doTERRA supplement line called the Lifelong Vitality System, or not Lifelong Vitality Pack. I love this nutrition system because it's designed to help close the gap between what we're eating and what our body actually needs. And when you incorporate these high value essential oils that are beneficial for cardiovascular system, for metabolic function and all kinds of things, you'll see a tremendous benefit that no other supplement can offer. And the fact that they're a whole food based supplement line means that your body is going to absorb anywhere from about 95 to 98% of the nutrients that are available through them. Unlike a lot of the products that are available on store shelves, which you may be lucky to get five to 10% if those products even include what they say that they have. A lot like in the essential oil world where purity and the actual products make a difference and, and you can't trust everything that you're handed, the same is in the supplemental world. So make sure that you're getting really high quality supplements no matter where you invest them. But for me and my family, we've had a lot of success with doTERRA supplement line and we really enjoy the lifelong vitality pack my clients who use these for at least 30 days have seen a huge difference lifelong vitality pack is the only product that doTERRA offers with a 30-day money-back guarantee and in my five plus years of sharing doTERRA I've yet to have anybody actually take advantage of that money back guarantee because at the end of those 30 days, even just the couple of clients that I've had who have said they didn't notice a difference, when they stop using the Lifelong Vitality Pack and the symptoms and struggles, concerns that they were having before they introduced this nutrition into their life come back, they realize what a difference a good supplement can make. So. It's worth your 30 days. It's worth giving it a shot. If you're looking for some support with your circulatory system, your metabolic system, whatever it is, Lifelong Vitality is a great place to start. With that, cinnamon bark is included in that. And the benefits of cinnamon bark have been known in use for centuries, as well as using a special blend of cinnamon for embalming. Ancient Egyptians also used it in bath oils, incense, and perfumes. In Indian practices, cinnamon is still used widely to reduce inflammation, ease joint pain, and reduce symptoms of headaches and ease poor digestion. I like to use cinnamon bark oil as a remedy for all of these. And yet, promoting a healthy circulatory system is ultimately number one on my list of most important uses of this amazing natural product. Using doTERRA cinnamon bark oil externally is a 
as easy as rubbing a small amount of diluted oil. You want to make sure you dilute it. Cinnamon bark is hot, but always, always, always dilute. And I'll give you how to do that in just a second. But dilute the oil and apply it all over the body. You'll see immediate effects, including helping your blood flow to extremities swiftly and increasing overall body temperature. Have you ever wondered why cinnamon is considered a wintertime smell? The warmth really has a factor. Um, so in order to apply any essential oil topically, for adults or children six and up, standard dilution is going to be one to two drops essential oil per teaspoon of carrier oil. And a carrier oil is any good quality vegetable oil. I personally like to use coconut oil or olive oil. If I'm making a roller bottle, I use fractionated coconut oil because it has no smell to it and doTERRA's does not go rancid. And so when we're talking about long living essential oils, essential oils that will last a long, long time, you want to make sure that you're using an oil that will be sustainable with it. And so uh, doTERRA's fractionated coconut oil is an excellent option, especially if you're making a roller bottle. But just one to two drops per teaspoon is plenty. Cinnamon is not necessarily one that I would recommend on young children, um, just simply because it is such a warm oil. If you feel that there is a need for cinnamon, contact me because I may agree with you and give you some safe ways to use it, um, or I may be able to steer you in a different direction. For other essential oils, topical dilution for children under the age of six, standard is one to two drops per tablespoon of carrier oil. So write that down, one to two drops per teaspoon for six and up, one to two drops essential oil per tablespoon of carrier oil for under six. And again, different oils for different ages, contact me if you would like to know more, I'm here to help. That being said, let's talk about a great way to include cinnamon bark in your diet by utilizing it internally. Adding it to casual everyday recipes like oatmeal, teas, and soups is a fabulous way to do it. Just a little bit goes a long way. I've included it. So I love this winter punch and apple cider vinegar uh, recipe below. Uh, just add all the ingredients together and simmer it at a low heat for about 10 minutes and let me know if you try it. So you'll want one drop of doTERRA cinnamon bark oil, one drop of doTERRA clove oil, three drops of lemon juice, one unpeeled orange sliced, two quarts of apple cider, cinnamon sticks for garnish. So simmer that at a low heat for about 10 minutes. And then when you go to serve it, if you add in a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar to this, it's very delicious, extremely beneficial for the gut, and wonderful for your circulatory system. So notice you have two quarts of apple cider and just one drop of cinnamon bark and one drop of clove in that whole recipe. That's huge, okay? It doesn't take very much. And make sure that you stir up really well before you serve it. Reproductive health is something that I converse with many, many families on. The human body is an extremely fascinating place. Multitudes of reactions, processes, and healing mechanisms take place every second of our life, many of which we barely need to think about. One such area of physical health, which some doTERRA products are especially good at assisting with, is our reproductive health. Particularly for women, reproductive health is something that requires a lot of balance and regulation of hormonal reactions. Essential oils like doTERRA's jasmine, thyme, neroli, rose, and geranium are all very good options to use in order to promote optimal reproduction, reproductive functionality. Many of these can also be beneficial in encouraging um, the mood in the bedroom. And so I encourage you to take a look back at my previous presentations and look for my love is then the air presentation, which has a lot of information on um, encouraging love in the bedroom and certain practices to go along with that. So anyhow, uh, doTERRA also produces a supplement called the phytoestrogen complex. 
I love this complex. It has been essential in my journey towards optimal wellness. This product combines nutrients and natural products, including essential oils, into one product and makes it easy to ingest and prepare. As essential oils go, rose is a pretty special one. In fact, rose is one of the most precious essential oils in the world and is also one of the most effective for balancing out emotions and mood. Did you know that it takes 242,000 hand-picked rose petals to yield just five milliliters of rose essential oil? Thankfully, just a drop of rose essential oil creates a beautiful aroma that soothes away stress, uplifts mood, and helps to promote balanced hormones. Wow. This is good stuff. This means that rose is among the best essential oils used to promote good reproductive health. When it comes to cooking recipes with rose oil, consider adding it to desserts for an extra boost of flavor and taste. I especially like rose paired with citruses like lime and lemon. Something a little different. Just remember that a little goes a long way when cooking with essential oils, especially as floral-based oils are highly concentrated and can be dangerous in excess to young children or pregnant women. If you have any questions, please let me know. But to use it in a recipe, just a toothpick, you can stick it through the dropper in the essential oil bottle and mix that into your recipe and see how it tastes, see how it goes. It's really hard to overdo it with essential oils, but you want to make sure that you are careful with them at the same time. Again, let me know if you have any questions. We talked about diluting on the previous page. As, so the immune system is vital for all kinds of things. Your immune system has an impact on good overall physical health, but it also has an impact on your skin quality, it has an impact on your cardiovascular system, it has an impact on everything that we've talked about so far and the things that we haven't talked about yet. The immune system blocks potential threats in form of infectious bacteria, toxins, and other external dangers. Keeping a strong immune system means strengthening ourselves to fight against these threats on short notice and as they arise. Tissues, cells, and small organs produce white blood cells, which are central to the main line of defense for the immune system. Through internal use, essential oils and natural supplements can help to promote the immune system and strengthen the production of these cells. Go-to oils for immune boosting include lemon, melaleuca, which is the purest form of tea tree oil, thyme, cinnamon bark, and wild orange, all of which can be used both internally and externally in a variety of different capacities. doTERRA's On Guard is a unique product which combines several of these oils and more to create a blend which provides powerful internal immunosupport. Containing cinnamon, wild orange, and eucalyptus, this blend, when used internally, may be cleansing, purifying, and strengthening for, immune, for the immune system. We also use On Guard all around our house, um, aromatically, helps to support immune function. We use it in our cleaning products. We use it for all kinds of things. Um, On Guard is extremely effective for helping to manage not just the wellness of your body, but really ultimately the wellness of your home. So we love this product. There's so many ways we put it to use. On the soles of the feet for immune strength. Now, You'll hear aromatherapists and essential oil enthusiasts talk a lot about applying essential oils to the feet. It may seem a little weird, but as essential oils are plants, their own defense mechanism, they have their own defense mechanism against disease, and it makes sense that they would do the same for us when applied correctly. There are various ways to ingest essential oils with a focus on boosting your immunity, and aromatherapy suggests that creating the ideal synergy between oils, which have similar qualities and properties, is key to effective use. When applied sparingly and to the soles of the feet, oils like clove, lemon, eucalyptus, and lavender are absorbed into the bloodstream within 20 minutes and to a cellular level within seven to 24 hours. It's important to note, however, 
that it's rare to hear recommendations of using undiluted oils on the skin or even at all. Oils are safe to use undiluted occasionally, not hot oils like clove or cinnamon or oregano, but some oils may be safe to use undiluted occasionally. My recommendation again is to always, always, always dilute. So if the dilution, let's talk about why real quick. Um, dilution helps to expand the amount of area that you can cover with the essential oil. So one drop will go a lot further when it's properly diluted instead of just covering a small area on your feet, on your legs, or over your heart. You can cover all three of those when it's properly diluted, which lowers the overall cost of using the essential oil. In addition to that, while there are no proteins or um, pollens contained within certified pure therapeutic grade essential oils, sensitivity may still occur and diluting helps to prevent sensitization. So just dilute, it helps to save money, helps to make it safer and helps it to last longer. It's a win-win-win in my book. Uh, so applying to the feet is an excellent way to boost the immune system against cold and flu, and even thought to be effective with symptoms of existing flu-like symptoms. When you apply to the feet, you are touching the reflex points for every major organ in your body. So it really is an excellent way to do it. Lemon, lemon essential oil is one of the most potent oils and one of our first go-tos when the immune system is compromised. Lemon stimulates white blood cell production and boosts immune, immunity against serious infections, including different seasonal impacts. Adding some drops of doTERRA lemon, oregano, and thyme to a veggie capsule and taking these daily alongside a healthy, balanced diet can be a great way to start supporting your immune system immediately. Cooking with the lemon essential oil. So as well as having immunity boosting properties, lemon essential oil also is also one of the most uplifting and inner invigorating oils to use in the home to stimulate positivity and clarity. As with all citrus oils, lemon is pressed directly from the peel of the fruit, making it extremely accessible and familiar to the taste buds. Diffusing it with a diffuser is great, but it's even more potent when you start learning how to bring these oils into the kitchen for both nutrition and flavor. Lemon can be used in both savory and sweet dishes as an additional flavoring or as a zing to summer, sa summer salads or as a tasty change to some flavored water. I love this recipe for lemon lime guacamole. Get your pen ready. For this, you'll need two ripe avocados, seeded and mashed, then add in one cup of red onion, finely chopped, two cloves garlic crushed, two drops doTERRA lemon citrus essential oil, two drops doTERRA lime essential oil, one small Roma tomato diced, two tablespoons of fresh cilantro leaves, finely chopped, and a little bit of salt to taste. Mash all those ingredients together and have at it. It's one of my favorite ways to get some healthy fats. Fats help to dilute essential oils properly. Again, you only need two drops of lemon and lime in this to make the whole thing zing. So delicious, absolutely wonderful. If you give this a try, come back and let us know what you think. And the nervous system is at the center of all of our bodily functions. It is the center of communication with nerve sending and receiving messages to and from the brain. This means that a healthy nervous system enables, a, enables us to think clearly and react accordingly in a way that is balanced and manageable. Essential oils promote calmness within the nervous system, helping to optimize sleep and removing us from the fight or flight mode in which much of our time now and days is spent. They can help generate a positive mood and overall more balanced emotions. They have this effect when used both internally and externally, in particular frankincense, lavender, bergamot, and basil. Using these oils as a complement to a healthy, balanced diet and lifestyle is sure to promote an overall sense of calmness and stability, reducing the feelings of nervous disorders and ensuring the mind and body to work at a 
compatible level of functionality. And that being said, I did want to give some caution. When you utilize citrus essential oils, especially oils like bergamot, topically, you are potentially exposing yourself to more sensitivity to sunlight. So please be cautious. We like to use bergamot aromatically most often. We will use it internally as well, but when using it topically, we make sure that we only apply it to an area that isn't going to be exposed to sun. Um, or we make sure that we safely keep ourselves out of the sun and away from UV rays for at least 72 hours following bergamot, at least 12 hours following any other central, uh, citrus essential oil. Um, there are a couple, just a handful of other ones that might add to sun sensitivity. Clair sage is one, uh, but primarily citrus essential oils. So just always be careful. That being said, you may find that in some of our spa products, there is a presence of some esen citrus essential oils. Those citrus essential oils have been expelled in a steam distilled manner, and that changes the chemistry. How you distill has an impact on it. Um, so that changes the chemistry so that those essential oils are no longer caustic to or likely to add to sun sensitivity. So just know if it's in a spa product, it's safe for topical use no matter what. But if you are making your own from these bottles directly, make sure that you either apply it in an area that is not going to be exposed to sun or avoid sunlight for a period of time. Now, with that, anytime you are looking to benefit the whole body, applying essential oils from the bottom of your spine where your tailbone is all the way up your neck will have an impact on your entire nervous system and is one of my favorite ways to leverage the power of essential oil. So a lot of times when I'm working with my clients on different protocols, different ways to support optimal wellness, I will have them apply it to both their entire length of the spine and their feet because then we're getting the entire nervous system and we're getting all of those vital organs a great way to utilize these essential oils. Again, make sure you always, always, always dilute no matter which essential oil you're using. With that, feelings of anxiety and essential oils. This is one of the most common ways that we leverage essential oils in our home. Anxiety is primarily a disorder or imbalance of the nervous system. It follows that so with that, it follows that targeting this area in order to soothe symptoms of anxiety is usually going to generate some positive effects. Feelings of anxiety can be caused by a variety of different things, such as lack of sleep, poor diet, lack of routine, stressful lifestyle factors. We've already discussed essential oils are thought to be helpful with at least some of these. Essential oils like lavender are especially beneficial in this area. Lavender is often considered a nervous system restorative aid and can help evoke a sense of inner peace. This also helps promote restful sleep and it may help with feelings of restlessness, irritability, panic, nervous stomach, and even general nervous tension. As with many essential oils, it is not recommended to ingest lavender in large doses. However, it is safe to do in small measure quantities. Now, if you're going to utilize essential oils internally, literally one to two drops at a time is all you need, okay? It's really difficult to overdo it with essential oils. You can utilize that as often as every 15 minutes if you need to, but start with small amounts. Small amounts more often is going to be more effective than a large amount all at once. Try one drop in a veggie capsule with some food or some drink like milk um, and try it at a similar time each day and see how it has an impact on your emotional wellness and your feelings of anxiety. I have a feeling that you will see a big difference when you do that. So have you ever been stuck with a bout of nausea at home and not been able to leave the house? Or maybe you want to resist using any medicinal drugs until you really can't stand it anymore. The good news is ginger root and ginger essential oil are thought to be effective in helping an upset stomach and or nausea. When ingested with warm water as an ingredient in herbal tea, 
Ginger essential oil is thought to aid in soothing indigestion and acidic reactions of the internal organs, which are associated with nausea and upset stomach. Plus, ginger itself has anti-inflammatory benefits. If you cannot stomach the taste of ginger, or if ginger tea is just a little too much for you, dilute and apply ginger to the inside of your wrist. These are reflex points for the vomiting reflux and can be extremely beneficial for those who are dealing with feelings of nausea, whether it's during pregnancy or otherwise. I hope you find that helpful. The respiratory system is responsible for the exchange of elements from internal to the external world. In general, it's understood in terms of oxygen intake and output of carbon dioxide. This exchange of molecules helps in removing toxins from the body. The primary organs involved in this exchange are the lungs. However, the skin is also included as it helps us to remove toxins in the form of sweat. Certain essential oils such as peppermint, eucalyptus, melaleuca, and lemon are very effective at helping the respiratory system to function at its highest as they encourage the expansion of the respiratory tracts and aid with clearing toxins such as mucus and damaging ingested substances. Because of the nature of the respiratory system, essential oils can have a very noticeable impact when used externally in the form of diffused air, inhaled aromas, etc. They can also be hugely effective when ingested, increasing the impact they have in the external environment. Peppermint is also used as an aid for digestive health, but its most noticeable effect is that of a cooling and easeful expansion of the airways and nasal pathways. For this reason, peppermint essential oil is often effective when diffused and also when ingested with herbal drinks, sweet dishes, or in a capsule. Again, just one to two drops at a time is plenty. Health-wise, peppermint has a direct and almost immediate effect on the respiratory system. It boosts the expansion of nasal passages along the body to take in more oxygen and clear block passages of toxins and potentially harmful substances. As a result, these increased levels of oxygen we end up with feeling higher levels of overall energy. Turn your water into a cooling and refreshing treat by adding a few drops of peppermint essential oil. I really like the um, taste of just a drop of peppermint and a drop of lemon in a huge 40 ounce bottle. It's plenty, it's lightly refreshing, just sweet enough and so delicious. The following essential oils are highly effective in helping to promote a healthy respiratory system. So make sure you write these down. Cedarwood essential oil, eucalyptus essential oil, lavender essential oil, peppermint essential oil, rosemary essential oil, melaleuca essential oil. The body responds differently to each of these in a variety of ways, so it's important to note that not all essential oils are safe to ingest, just like not all plants are safe to eat, okay? So typically, if a plant is safe to eat, it is safe to utilize as an essential oil internally. doTERRA makes this really easy for us though, all you have to look for on the bottle is a supplement label. If it does not have the supplement label, don't take it internally. If you have questions, message me, email me, call me if you have my phone number, because I am happy to help guide you and direct you in that way. So are you an athlete or massage therapist? You need to try doTERRA's Deep Blue Rub. Love, love, love this blend of essential oils. Many massage therapists and athletes are now becoming aware of the physical benefits of essential oils. In addition to promoting an overall calmer disposition and balanced emotional state, preferable for competitive sports, many of doTERRA's products are designed specifically with physical healing from energies, from injuries in mind. Our Deep Blue Rub is highly effective at providing relief from aches, pains, and sports-related 
injuries. It also promotes antibacterial and antiviral properties, boosting the immune system and boosting the respiratory pathways. While this rub essentially is absorbed through the skin and towards the problem area, it's important to know that it is for external use only. The muscle pain and tension relief provided is instigated primarily by the unique blend of wintergreen, camphor, peppermint, lang lang, helichrysum, blue tansy, blue chamomile, and osanu oils. It also provides a deep moisture to the skin and acts as an effective relief for dry skin. If you are battling feelings of indigestion, digestive health, and essential oils might not initially seem to be obviously linked. However, many recent studies which focus on the gut-brain connection have proven that there is a direct correlation between digestive health and overall feelings of happiness and well-being. This means that indigestion and digestive disorders actually increase your risk of developing mental health disorders such as anxiety or depression. Therefore, many functional and natural health practitioners have turned to essential oils and other natural remedies to help ease digestive discomfort and promote a higher level of happiness and well-being among users. Optimal wellness from head to toe. doTERRA has several natural oil products which may help significantly improve feelings of indigestion and boost overall mood and happiness. You can learn more about the gut-brain connection, write this down, by going to health dot harvard dot edu forward slash diseases slash and dash conditions forward slash the gut brain connection right just search harvard edu diseases and conditions gut brain connection it's a great study look it up fabulous information um, in helping to promote digestion, there's all kinds of different oils that can be beneficial. So just as sensory organs are vital to our functionality and experiencing of the world around us, as they allow us to take in information and energy in, our digestive system serves as a mean of elimination of the negative elements. This means that digestive system extracts the positive elements from the food that we eat and leaves behind any unwanted waste to release from the body. In this way, the digestive system is also a kind of protective system. It's important to, in that it ensures we receive the right amount of nutrients from the food that we eat. Foods with higher density of nutrients allow us to receive more benefits, and those with less will be expelled mostly as waste products. Essential oils help with discomfort associated with indigestion and also gets the stools moving. A fascinating study on the benefits of essential oils for the digestive system noted that thyme and rose oils primarily, their primary ingredients, which are thymol and geraniol, could be effective in suppressing pathogens in the small intestine with no concern for beneficial commensal colonic bacteria and digestive gut. Sorry for tripping over my tongue there. Essentially, what we're saying is that by supporting immune function in the digestive tract, thyme and rose oil may help ease indigestion and allow for a more comfortable digestive experience while having no negative effect on the beneficial bacteria in your gut. That's huge. As somebody who has studied nutrition and the link between the good bacteria in your gut and the overall function of your emotional and physical wellness, that's huge. So leverage thyme and rose oils for all of their benefits. Various essential oils that can help with hair health. Now, a lot of people come to me um, for myself, hormonal balance, age, things like that, have thinned out my hair. Um, Managing hair health is essential at all ages, but I love that essential oils can be leveraged for hair growth, thickening, and helping to support positive scalp wellness, strengthening hair, improving shine, natural lightening of hair, all kinds of things. doTERRA has many essential oil-based products that are made specifically for the hair. All of these incorporate different essential oils which are highly beneficial for hair growth and overall wellness. Love it. 
All right, so let's talk about the integumentary system. Many of us don't consider the skin when we're accounting for the major organs of the body, yet the skin is one of the most important organs of the body, and it has many protective and excretory functions. It makes up a huge part of the integumentary system. Now, our skin is actually a great place to determine our overall wellness. Clear skin, free of bumps, free of just discomfort, free of all kinds of things, often means that the internal system is doing well as well. Uh, the integumentary system is comprised of hair, skin, nails, and exocrine glands. And as such, it deals primarily with our interactions with the external environment and protects the bodies from these dangers. But in the same breath, it's easily affected by toxins, artificial fragrances, artificial ingredients, pollution, and other irritants. Treating the hair, skin, and nails with natural products like essential oils helps to maintain smoothness, brightness, and overall feelings of good health and functionality. Oils like melaleuca help with cleansing pores and keeping a clean complexion, while jojoba oil is great as both a carrier oil to dilute other oils and itself as a deep moisturizer. Lang Lang, sandalwood, lavender, and rose are all great options to use on your skin and nails. Just as we've talked about, make sure that you dilute so that you avoid undesired reactions and help to increase the length of time that you can use those oils. With that, let's make a cleansing skin scrub. So get your pens and pencils ready because I have another recipe for you. There are endless ways that you can combine doTERRA essential oils to make, a many, to make amazing skincare products, but here's one of my favorite skin scrub recipes. So you'll need one cup of sugar. It's the only way that I like to use sugar. If you read my recipes, you know we don't use a lot of that in our home. Um, half cup of coconut oil. You can put in a teaspoon of jojoba oil or shea butter to go along with that. If you're using shea butter, you want to use a stand mixer to mix it up because shea butter is pretty thick. But anyhow, a little bit, just a tablespoon of each of, the, of either of those will help increase the moisture level of this. 20 drops of doTERRA lemon essential oil. Now remember what I said about citrus oils. You wanna make sure that you use the skin scrub primarily at night or on a day where you're not going to be out in the sun. 10 drops of lavender essential oil and 10 drops of melaleuca essential oil. Mix these ingredients together in a bowl and then transfer to a jar or more sustainable container. Ideally something with glass or stainless steel and store it up. Let me know if you give this a try. If you have any skincare rituals involving oils, what would you like to share? Leave them in the comments below. I'd love to hear what's worked for you. Oily skin and lemon oil. Now this has become a vital part of my children's lives. So if you have naturally oily skin, some people might think that oily skin is a sign to avoid using additional oils in your healthcare regimen. There's actually certain oils which assist with the excess sebum on the skin and helps to tighten pores, allowing for shininess and oily skin to appear drier and more manageable. We've already talked about the respiratory and energizing effects of lemon essential oil, but did you know when used topically on the skin, lemon essential oil has a stringent astringent qualities and it helps to keep your oily skin fresh and clean. Make sure you recognize the fact that lemon essential oil is sun absorbent so it's best to avoid getting in the sun after using this even when it's diluted. So use this at night before you go to bed so you have that 12 hours that you need between application and going out in the sun and that way you can utilize it safely. But it is a beautiful way to leverage the power of lemon essential oil. If you're just starting out on your essential oil journey, it can be difficult to know which oils to invest in first. Write a list of your needs so that we can discuss what's best for you and then reach out to me on Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram, email me, whatever you're most comfortable with. Um, your desires might include targeting specific aches and pains, helping to relieve feelings of anxiety, creating a bright, energetic home environment, boosting skin and hair health, and so many other options. When you've narrowed down your priority areas, let me know. 
We'll most likely start with two or three areas and recommendations and go from there. A beautiful way to begin your essential oil journey is by leveraging the power of peppermint, lavender, and lemon. They are three of the top 10 oils that I recommend everybody has on hand at all times. Uh, but literally there's 101 plus uses for these three essential oils alone. Great place to get started. We've almost reached the end of our time together today, but really your journey is just getting started. Your journey to most more balanced, healthy, and happy life with essential oils starts here. doTERRA essential oils are an amazing complement to all walks of life as they will help you go from living purely healthy lifestyle to a lifestyle where you can finally thrive. I'm interested to hear what your biggest takeaway from our time together has been. Please leave some comments below or feel free to email me directly. Now's your chance if you have any questions regarding anything that we've covered today, let me know in the comments below. Feel free to leave feedback about your experience today as well. To stay on top of the most up-to-date essential oil, natural solution, and nutrition information, please be sure to follow my blog and loveit2.com. Follow my Facebook page, Instagram, and Twitter, which are all and love it too, A-N-D-L-O-V-E-I-T-T-O-O. And of course, be sure to hit the subscribe button below so you'll be notified when new information is available here on YouTube as well. Thank you so much for spending your afternoon here with me today. I really hope that you've gotten some good tools from this event, which will further your understanding of essential oils and help maximize your use going forward. As always, I'll be available to answer your questions, leave them below, or feel free to message me privately. Thank you. I wish you the best of luck.